Hi there, it's Mr. Clark. Welcome to our final three choice variation lesson 10.CC.5. So, uh, what I'm thinking for this one is maybe it's just a piano variation. Um, we haven't been a lot of de decently similar texture going on uh, to keep that 7 8 feel, except for, you know, the, the chorale. Um, so, yeah, I don't think I'm going to use the clarinet at all. It's just piano this time. And, and that's, that's okay. So let's put in some repeats. And then put in the bass line. But oh, the harmonies are kind of contained in the melody look for the most part anyway. So maybe I just have not, not that wrong, wrong key pad. And we just have that kind of texture and then up to G flat. Then E flat. A flat. D flat. I can throw in some of the E flat. F G and a da 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 da. Let's see. I dig this. Um, I think it needs a bit of a da 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 da. -da. Maybe not fashion. Okay, so I got my E flat, basic E flat, F, D flat, or down one key, G. C, A flat, B flat, C, B flat, G flat, A flat, D flat. Okay, so keeping that rhythmic idea. Do, do. Sort of ending. Okay, let's hear this. Well, that was a little rhythmic, I think, do you think? Okay, that worked better with the um, separation. The registral separation. Okay, so... I think this all goes up an octave. Yeah, okay. Okay. 
Yeah, because before it started sounding more too much like be flat out, be better do one by one going down there as part of the melody, but it's not. Okay, so I got my final variation, and I'll see you next time. Put them together. <laughs>